What's up YouTube? This is a uh, product review for Zoomed's uh, New Zealand Sphagnum Moss. Um, I use it in my snake tank um, around his hide and around his water bowl just to uh, give him a little more extra humidity. Also I use um, spray bottles to uh, spray that down every other day every morning he's chilling in there right now sorry about the flash but uh... that's that for my frogs up here they need a lot of humidity um... so i took some eco earth and i uh... mixed in some sphagnum moss just so it can hold a couple a little bit more uh... humidity Sorry about that. Um, also, I have the towel on top just to hold in some more humidity. Um, so, that's that. Um, the instructions are pretty simple. You uh, just take some out. It's really dry in the box, obviously. Very dry. Um, you take as much as you need out, put it in some water, let it sit. Um, then you wring it out and put it into your terrarium or vivarium or wherever you're putting it in. Um, it looks great down there on the floor of your terrarium. It kind of blends in with the aspen bedding. Or uh, you can have it hanging or anything. Um, the box says it's good for a lot of stuff. Um, frogs, geckos, toads, anything really that needs a high amount of humidity. Um, if you watch my other videos, you know that I like Zoomed. Um, it says it's the number one preferred moss in a viv vivarium application. So, I mean, it's true sphagnum moss. No dyes. Um, put that back. Um, other dyes, I mean, other moss that I've seen um, and read reviews about, um, the dye will actually come out and your animal will be green or the stuff inside your terrarium would be green because the dyes run out. Um, but this is pretty good. A little skinny squirt right there. You go buy some crickets uh, either today or tomorrow. But uh, there's one right there. Squirt up there. And uh, Waldo somewhere in there. But uh, thanks for watching. And comment, rate, subscribe. Inbox to me. Any suggestions or comments. And uh, I'll get back to you guys as soon as I can. Thanks.